Hey there, Chad Bonji here for Ohio University Libraries. A number of the business cluster students are currently researching the Ohio tourism industry. And what they're finding, it's really hard to find local information for the state or different counties of Ohio. Simply Map's a good resource that can help you find people who are interested in doing tourist activities, such as going to theme parks or museums by county in the state of Ohio. It won't tell you how many people from other states want to come to Ohio, but it will at least tell you how many people in Ohio or percentage of people in Ohio who are interested in going to tourist-like activities. So this video gives you an example of how you might use Simply Map to get a ranking of counties of people who are like very interested in going to like things like theme parks or museums, or how to map those various variables. Hopefully this helps you get a better understanding of your local Ohio market. So what we want to do is compare a number of different variables across the counties in Ohio. We could also do cities or zip codes if you wanted to as well. And let's say, for example, we want to compare a number of people who attend museums or theme parks in Ohio. Uh, what we'll do is we'll go up under New Tabular Report, and we'll do what's called a Location Analysis Report. And I'm just going to launch the Location Analysis Wizard here, choose Locations, and we'll do States, and then we'll go down and choose Ohio, and then use this location. Next, we'll go under Variables. And I'm going to start uh, in the Simmons Local section uh, for this particular area. And I'm going to go under Entertainment and Leisure, under Theme Parks, under Theme Parks again. And the variables will show up over here on the right-hand side. So I want uh, the percent who have actually attended a theme park in the last 12 months. We'll use that variable. And so now we have a list of, of, our, of our variables. If we want, we can go add more by clicking on variables here. And let's say you want to search for um, people who attended museums. We could type museums there, do a new search. And once the data loads there, here we have percent who enjoy visiting museums. We can use that variable too and close that. And now by location, we're going to have uh, each, each area there. And what we can do is actually go under and sort uh, descending to get by each variable to get the highest percentage in each area. So that's a good way to measure interest in various kind of tourist activities. Um, you can even go and look at things of people who have camped in RVs or enjoy uh, going to the movies or, or, or going to concerts or things like that. So a great way to uh, find local data on uh, tourist activities uh, in Ohio. If you wanted to, you can map one of these variables. Uh, the best way to do this is go up and create a new tab, or actually let's just do a new map, and launch map wizard, do variables. You can actually click on recent. Let's close out of that, click on recent. And so for example, I can use this variable here. And close that. Let's go under locations, because right now we're looking at Harlan, Iowa for some reason. Let's go under locate locations, click on recent, and we can look at Ohio, use this location. And then if you want to, you can drill down um, uh, and look at, look at things that way. So, so that gives you a nice uh, map uh, with percentages, and you're looking at the state there, people who are uh, enjoy or have visited museums in the past uh, 12 months or so. It's a good way to get a map of, of your data that way. Best of luck of your research on this project. Hopefully you get a better understanding of the Ohio tourism industry through using Simply Map. If you need more help, look for the contact link on the business blog. We'll be glad to help you. Take care and have a great day.